Okay, I thought I'd try this uh, 10 to 30 BR on the uh, Nikon 1J5. It looks pretty good. So it gives me a 27 to, let's see, a 30. Yeah. like a 75 so 27 to 75 or 28 to 75 kind of close um, I've been looking at some other lenses like the RF 28 to I think it's 70 but uh, this is at the wide end right here um, so that's 10 I think you can go to 13 on the other one. So this is like a 35 right here. And I'm holding it out. But you know, this looks smaller because I have it at 14 right now. Then uh, the 6.7 to uh, 13 millimeter, which is an 18 to 35. So this is a 14. It's like a uh, a 40, 41. So this looks smaller, but how does this look? So if you're vlogging, it's a small lens, okay? Uh, if you're vlogging, I'm looking good, I'm not shaking or anything. I'm looking at the background. Uh, it is stabilized on the lens, and it's stabilized on the uh, uh, camera. And I'm walking around. Trying to figure out if I'm going to move the grass or not. Yeah, I'm looking around. I've watered my plant. I may have to water it again. It's drooping. I just watered it about uh, a few hours ago. Do it again. Might be insects too. I was hoping these would bloom, but I don't think they are. Ooh, saw a spider. See it? Yeah, I'm moving closer. See it right there? So he has a little nest. Yep. A lot of insects, folks. So I'll put it back at 30. So, this type of video only lasts for about so long. My battery's ready to draw, you know die on me so I'll exchange a battery put this on the battery charger the picture quality looks good I have no complaints it really looks good so I thought I'd try out another vlog like this I'll change the battery and put on the um, my favorite which is the 6.7 to 13 millimeter 18 to 35 so even then, this was the first kit lens that came out. It's pretty good. So let me go over here. Turn on the light. There you go. Okay. So I, I'm liking the colors. Here's the camera. You can see how small it is. And this is uh, 30 millimeters right here. Autofocus. Okay. So I am filling. I am filling out. I didn't put it out all the way. I guess I had only at 14. Okay. So this is at 10. 
which is like 27 so it looks pretty good okay folks let's get on to the next next test I'll put this video up with the uh, 6.7 to 13 so I'm a little bit smaller on this if I go all the way to the top part yeah this is uh, the 35 so the other one was a little bit uh, bigger I didn't put it out all the way so I was trying to figure out why is 10 to 30 seem smaller than this one no why now so you see I can fill the picture pretty good but this is all the way at uh, 35 so the other one was at 27 you know it's not that well I think it was at the beginning of 27 I think it went up to 40 so this is only at 35 so I'm not filling up the, uh, the whole space let's walk in the dark a little bit let's turn on some lights So a little light here, a little bit light there. Um, I do wish you could do 4K video second, but I have a video. This is 1080-60. It's okay. You know, you don't need 4K. 1080C or 60 will get rid of all the shakes. So right now, I'm going to leave it at uh, 35 millimeters. Just walk around. No, it's at sunset. I think they both have the same apertures. 3.5 to 5.6. So I see it looks smooth. I don't see any shaking. Here's my dog. We're trying to see what's going on. He probably wants more food. He probably killed that bird too. Yeah, my dog was going to eat it, but I took it from her. So, make sure I put out the garbage tomorrow and the recycle. So, happy Father's Day. Hope he had a good meal. He probably ended up paying for it. <laughs> Take a look at me. So, anyway. Yeah, walking around. I'm looking at the piles that the cat uses to do his mess. Which I don't mind. And you see, he's coming back. He's chilling. So it's just a quick vlog. Now, I'm going to go. This is why I like it. This is how you test. You want a wide field of view behind you, but you still want to see the individual talk. And the nice thing about having a wide field of view is while you're talking, if your hand goes down or up or stuff, you're still in the frame, still in the picture. Always look at the bulb. So if I looked at the bulb, can, I'm, I'm not centered, okay? So on smaller cameras, you may have to go a little bit lower, which is fine by me because uh, it gets heavy just holding it straight out. And I, I've been, when I do vlog, it seems like it's down here most of the time because they're heavy cameras and I'm not used to it. I'm used to putting the camera down on the table and um, just stand back or, you know, sit back. You know, if I'm at a picnic table or something like that. This is what you do, okay? So I'm gonna walk around here. And I've been recording for four minutes, okay? It's not overheating. HD, 1060. I think it's a 17 minute uh, time limit. Record limit, that is. Which is okay. You know, you just do a, a short clip here and there. 
I got a terabyte SD card in this bad boy. I think it's a terabyte. I'm not sure. Not 256 gigabytes at least. But you see, going around vlogging. I'm gonna show off the tree. Looks pretty good, doesn't it? Haven't been watering it all season, but I wanted to show you this. So they haven't done any work, which is nice and quiet. Building a hospital. I plan to go there shortly to take some pictures. And I want to show you this tree. It's really come alive. So I water it at night time, you know, about now, because it's at sunset. And then I also do it at uh, in the morning. After I have breakfast and wake up. Keep the tree alive so it, it's moist down there. That's good. But you see it's blooming finally. And the flowers don't stay on. Once it gets real hot, they start falling off. But still, it's a beautiful tree. I love it. This was planted at the same time as that one. But that tree, some people cut off limbs and stuff like that. Or the lawnmower hit it. Uh, when the guy does the ditch. So anyway, this is just a quick vlog to let you know what's going on. Thank you for watching. Hope you like this type of content. Uh, a little bit of camera. Five minutes here and there. Battery lasts okay, but I got like five batteries. And uh, another week I'll finally get the dummy battery for this thing. Uh, I ordered the uh, version 3 of the Nikon one. So they're waiting to uh, ship it. And when they do, it's expedited. So I'm happy about that. I'll get it probably the next day or the next two days after that, once they ship it. They do it kind of like an express. And they do it once a week. That's fine by me. I should be done with all these. I have all the lenses now except for the 10 millimeter f2.8 which should be coming thursday and i'll try that out too so i have some more content um, i'm also going to do uh i keep putting off the uh eleanor so the sony zv1 i'll be doing some pictures uh comparison between a 60 megapixel to uh, a 12 megapixel camera both full frame. So anyway, stay tuned for that. Thank you for watching. Stay safe. Keep smiling. And I'll see you next time. Goodbye, folks. Have a wonderful day.